Okay, so let's get straight into this video. Today, I'm going to be doing two things. Um, so my hair is ginger right now. Like, well, it's like more orange. And it was cute at first and it still is kind of cute, but I'm just kind of tired of it. I get really tired of my hair really fast. So I'm going to be putting a rinse on my hair. Um, I'm using one of the clear all rinses and I'm using it in just black. I feel like black would be fine. I didn't want to get the jet jet black because sometimes it could just be too harsh. And then after I do that, I'm going to be using this Afro G texture treatment. I used this before and when I tell you guys, this is bomb. Like, bomb. Y'all need to get this. So, before you use rinses, you're supposed to clarify your scalp um, and your hair. So, I'm going to be using these two packets that the hair store keep giving me because they keep giving, giving me this every time I buy something. It's this Cribernetra Pure Honey Moisturizing Dry Defense Shampoo and has no sulfates or mineral oil. Um, so, I'm going to use this to wash my hair. I'm going to see how it works. If I feel like it didn't clarify my hair enough, I'll go in with a different shampoo. But, I just want to use this first. So... Yeah, I'm looking pretty rough. Um, so as you can see, my hair is orange. I do like this color, but I'm just I'm I'm just wondering for black because I feel like black goes everything. And I'm thinking about doing a black bob with a six by five closure. So I kind of my my um uh, <laughs> my ends are gonna be out. So I need them to be you know black. So yeah, so I'm going to wet my hair and open these packets and start using this shampoo. So instead of me putting this in a bowl or anything, since it has this um, cap, I'm just going to apply it to my hair and kind of move it around. guys i figured that this would happen and it really wasn't that bad that's why i'm just trying to see if i can go over some parts with the the rinse again some parts of my hair turn green um sometimes that happens when there's like blondish or it's too light of a color and you go black because it's how the color real works i don't know um i remember watching it on some hair videos so i figured that might happen i just wanted to see if this will work so i'm gonna put this 
so a little bit more dye on the little parts that turn green because it, it wasn't that many parts that turned green um so i'm just going to apply the rinse for a second time um for the same amount of time and then i'm going to go in with the apple g treatment okay so the tops of my hair is still a little greenish actually let me look at it yeah it's still a little greenish but um i'm not gonna really have my hair out so i'm just gonna leave it be for right now and then i'm gonna go in with my texture treatment if i can get it open um but yeah that's just i forget somebody like some youtuber or hairstylist explained i think it was brad mondo i watch his videos all the time um but basically like it's the colors in the color wheel so sometimes if you're doing too much of a, a drastic change um you know so black your hair will turn green so i knew there was a possibility of that happening but i didn't think it would really happen so okay so i put the apple g treatment in my hair and you're supposed to only leave it in for about a minute but i left it in for 10 minutes because that's what people usually did on youtube and that's what i've been using this whole time and i just rinsed it out with cool water okay so my Afro G treatment definitely worked. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I can tell that my hair is just a tad more curly. Um, it just looks a little livelier. My curl, my curls look a little bouncier. All of that, all of that. But my hair is green. And like I said earlier, I figured that this would happen. So I did my research, and I think that red will cancel this green now. So only red that I have right now, I have this Demi Permanent um, Red Velvet from Kiss Colors, their Temptation line. So I have this Red Velvet, so I'm gonna put it in a in a little bowl, if I could get it out. <laughs> and I'm gonna mix it with a little bit of black dye as well and see what happens because I've seen other people do this. Okay, so as you can see, my hair is like burgundy now. Um, and again, I'm pretty sure this is a very, um, what am I trying to say? <laughs> this is like, this is not a permanent solution, I'm pretty sure, because I'm using Demi Permanent Color. So, um, I'm just doing this for right now because I want my hair to be black because I, I'm pretty sure I'm doing a jet black bob next week and my edges are going to be out because it's six by five closure and I mean I could brush them all the way back um but when it was green you know that probably would have poked through just a just a tab because when I have different color hair under my wigs I do try to conceal it the best way I can but you know if that wind blow a little gust of wind come you know it's gonna be trying to embarrass you so yeah, I'm just going to go back in and put the black down my hair and see if that'll work. And then I'm going to come back. And because I didn't put my hair through so much, she's definitely getting a good condition tonight. Okay? Because this is a lot. Like, I didn't rinse out my hair about 50 times. But, yeah, I'm going to see if this works. And then I'm going to come right back. As you can see, um, didn't work. Um, which I figured it wouldn't, but I just wanted to give it a try. So I'm just styling my hair because I didn't know if I was going to be going anywhere the next day. And I didn't want my hair to look crazy. So I'm putting a couple waves in on the side and I'm just going to slip down my hair in the middle. Um, nothing too crazy. But um, definitely don't do what I did, you guys. I thought this was going to take me two seconds and it ended up taking me way longer. Than I needed to so if you're trying to dye your hair back black try to make sure you have a reddish tone in your hair or it'll turn green and you don't want to do that because we don't like that
Okay, so these are my final results. As you can see, my hair is a burgundy color. It's not what I wanted, but it's better than green. So, um, I will probably try to get my hair to black in the um in a later video but right now i'm just gonna leave my hair alone because it is very stripped and i just wanted to style it so it wasn't you know looking crazy just in case i had to go to the store or something while you're here don't forget to subscribe don't forget to like this video um stay tuned for more videos because i have a lot of natural hair videos wig videos everything that you want and everything that you need period bye